Welcome back to another video of Supermarket Simulator. Anyway, let's play. So we did stock taking already. Most of our boxes are still outside. And now we're just going to get some customers in. Yeah, almost at clients and customers at the same time. Go in, bro. Go buy my shop empty. So we, we roughly at the moment make about $3,000 per day on average, which is a good amount. And I think we can, we can get uh, maybe two more product licenses um, before we have to expand. We can do another shelf looking this way, another shelf looking away, and then potentially, hopefully fit in two more here. That would be quite a bit of uh, income then, before we have to expand. But yeah, so far, like this is like part four, I think. We're having a phenomenal start. I think so far out of the whole run, uh, there was only two clients, I think, that was unhappy, if I'm not mistaken. Maybe three. Uh, two about the price and one that there is no item on the shelf that we fixed immediately and no one else complained about it, so. But normally managers or CEO of a shop like this. Hey, I was standing on that, bro. Goodness. Um, they normally stand outside the entrance. And I think it's for reasons like this. Whether someone complains about something. That you need to get your hands on. And we have our two workers that keep stuck in the shelves, obviously. And they're doing a good job. They get stuck sometimes. Um, the issue still is that I will keep reminding people. Because I feel like it's a coding issue that the coder needs to fix that program the game. What happens is, if there is an item that has low stock... Um, but there's a box outside with set item. Uh, the helpers will take the item from the outside and then try and put it in uh, on the shelf. But what should happen is if there's an item on the shelf or on, in storage of the set item, that one should take priority over the one that's outside. Because what happens now is we have a box, let's say we have, I don't know, milk, and inside the milk container, there's like three pieces of milk inside the storage. But now they grab a full milk outside. They try and take the full milk inside, uh, but it doesn't consume the whole box. Now you have two boxes with three different pieces of milk. And then the guy just stands there and say, hey, listen, I don't have anywhere to put this. But if you use the one inside first, then that, that issue would have never happen in the first place. I hope that makes sense. The stock outside should only be used if there's nothing in storage. So st uh, stock from the storage needs to be stockaded first. That is what I'm saying. And it's an easy fix. It's honestly an easy fix. Um, it's just a change in priority list, literally from top to bottom, like how it works. Those two lines just need to swap. So this is exactly what happens. So now he has bleach. There's two spots available. So if I take this bleach and I open it up, you will see that there's four spots available. So you should have taken this one first to, to put it there. And then this would have never occurred. It's it's the best example I have. It's it. It happens a lot with bigger items. It's more noticeable with bigger items. And I don't think this issue will go away. Unless I like double rack. Meaning I have two spots for bleach to be stocked at. Other than that, I think the only thing that I would like the developer to change is have a quality of life function 
on on the PC or literally when you're setting one price that if you click on a price and you click on market price to be exactly market price um, or uh, to have a quality of life purchase let's say you pay ten thousand dollars for this quality of life that will just auto make everything auto um, market price every day so that we don't have to like oh look at the prices now this is different that is different and i have to go run around and look for it because at the moment it's it's roughly about three to four items per day already for me and i can't imagine if you have like the final license like how many items you have in total then how much uh prices difference there is then i'll have to most probably take a screenshot and go back to it and it's it's not cool there should be a quality of life uh purchase uh, a service or even even a worker that does this if it's a worker then it shouldn't be a an expensive fee maybe like a hundred dollars per day the guy comes in work for one day change the prices to the standard or oh, there's no chicken And we should also buy potatoes. Another guy complaining about chicken. We almost made it through a whole day without anyone complaining again. But it's these big items, dude. These big items is really an issue. We can only stock four in each side. They should have made it where you can stack on top of that as well. Because in real life, when I go buy chicken, uh, chicken are stacked on top of each other also. Sometimes it's in between. Other than that, it's actually not a big deal. I mean, those customers is 100% my fault for them not finding their chicken. I think I just heard a gunshot in real life. <laughs> so I don't really have my headphones on right now. Yeah, man, I live in South Africa, dude. The most dangerous country in the world. What's it now? Two sugars. How much is in here? Three. Hmm. Fun day, dude. It's a it's an honest like coding error that he just needs to fix or she whoever made this game. Okay, I think everyone's out of the store, yeah. Okay, we can end the day, and then we can do stock uh, restocking again. So candy, honey, and a sugar. Candy. Uh, honey. And which sugar, though? This one? Oh, rot. Let's do stock taking. I mean, it's going to be hard to do stock taking while there's so many products outside.
Trust me, this yogurt tastes nice. It's been in the sun for two days. Whatever. Whatever. We need more toilet paper, my buddy. I mean, where's the yogurt? There it is. Whoop, did it is. Normally we can use a full box here. Because the guys restocking don't really like to go to items that's a lot, like yogurt and, and butter. It's like their last resorts, you know, stuff. I don't know how that cool drink got there, by the way. I swear it wasn't me. But I'm just leaving it there. We might actually have... We do. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness, bro. See, this is why I don't want to restock as well, because, like, issues happen. So, what did we replace there? It was one of the sodas, right? Uh, it should be this one. There we go. Okay, we're just gonna restock as is. Like, I don't know what is outside. It seems like mostly just... Okay, there's something. So, don't restock on butter. Or yogurt. Or potatoes. So then we'll start from the bottom up. So it is... <clears throat> chicken... Let's start from the bottom up. So it is... Uh, well, we should check this first. It's potato. Chicken. Um, I don't think it's butter. No, we don't need that. It's the sugar. Uh, then red cheese, bleach, and spray. So red cheese, spray, bleach. Bleach, uh, toilet paper, definitely. We'll buy toilet paper twice. So then we have white cake. Okay, that's lower. So cereal, chocolate, uh, red cake. The cereal, chocolate, red cake. Um, six pack milk, six pack, six pack milk, soda, uh, cream soda, 
Cream soda. Looks like salt. We'll buy two salts. Because it's very small. So two salts. Then we have... Olive oil. Um, olive oil. Olive oil, a red. Um, peanut butter, eggs. Uh, water, cheese, oil, and blue. Water, oil, cheese, and blue. This feel like something I'm missing. I think that's fine. Okay, we didn't make much money between yesterday and today because we're still on 2,400. We barely made anything. Yeah, we do need a third worker, that's for sure. The cracks are starting to show in the strategy. Okay, let's just have a look here. Level 29, so two levels, well, one level and a, a bit away. To get 13 racks, which is way too much uh, for where we are. So we probably will have to improve or increase our storage. For no reason, but it doesn't matter. Hey girl, she looks like Let's Play Master Color. <laughs> the neon on the board. It's only neon during the day. During the night, it's like there's no light, which is so weird. So I'm honestly just hoping that we can actually start making profit again. Because we made profit, we made killings in the past few days. But two days ago we were on like $250. After we upgraded everything, all the fridges and stuff. All the deep freezers for... You know, our french fries, pizza and... And chicken. How are we doing on chicken? Good. Do you guys know if the developer is still working on the project? Because I saw... His last update was like more than a month ago. I thought there's going to be like really cool updates. Doesn't show here. We have so much traffic coming in here every day.
We have potatoes outside. It's not stocked inside yet, inside the storage. This other stuff protects priority right now. You see, so what I would recommend is if the if the change is too hard for the developer, is to just if they pick up an item here. For example, I have bleach on my hand, right? It would be better to go to the storage with this bleach and then swap it out. Whatever bleach is there. Maybe not swap it out, but like Yeah, swap it out would be fine. Mm. Swap it with a lower box, I don't, I don't know. If there's no storage inside, right, then it should use the storage outside. Uh, boxes that hasn't been opened yet. And you could put in a clause as well. Like use the outside storage as long as the box get destroyed. Because now, the, look at this again. What is that? That's potatoes. Don't I have potatoes here also? I do. So this, uh, this one has two. This one has three. But he grabbed the one that's outside that also has... Uh, that was also full. So this is a serious issue that needs to get addressed. I also wish I could switch the light switch to like here or somewhere or something. Also something I didn't know, but it's it's how it works in a game that's very similar to this. Uh, it's another game called uh, TCG uh, Card Shop Simulator or whatever. Um, apparently the faster you serve people... There's only, there's only a certain amount of people allowed on the street. Not everyone will walk into your store unless you have a very high popularity or, you know, something like that. Um, so the faster you get them out of your shop, the faster they'll walk away and despawn for someone else to spawn in, in their place. To also potentially come to your shop. I didn't know that that's a thing. So us getting on random 50 customers. It might be because we have a queue. And that means our... Dude, aren't you standing a bit close? Goodness, she's like, I'm next, bitch. So it might mean it, it will... It won't make sense to buy another cash, like another self-checkout. But in that case, where if we do have a queue, we lose potentially new customers spawning in from the road. Uh, means that it will be more beneficial to have another cashier, or another self-checkout. Yeah, we're making a killing, guys, honestly. We're making an absolute killing. So just by that factor alone, I think we'll buy another South Cash Out. And I can place it here. I think we want the... Is it the Mer... I, I don't know which one it is. It's one of the two. We'll buy the mirrored one. Obviously, we'll end the day first. Yeah, we made a thousand five hundred dollar profit. So olive oil and hand soap. Oh 
my goodness, dude. That's a $7 out of oil and hand soap. Uh, uh, $1.50. That should be good. Okay, let's buy the self checkup. Because if you, if you think about it that way, it makes sense, right? We don't want people to queue at all. Oh, it's the same as the first one. And that would also make sense to remove that one then. So the people can walk through this. So they, they still can't. They can walk through this one. So in and out, dude. That's that's what we want with our shop. So let's do stock taking. Uh, can we even? Honestly, don't think so. See, so I can't move through it, but I think they will be able to. We did put the cold ring back, right? To the right spot. I honestly don't even know. So I'll do stock taking. If if we get stuck, it's not a big deal. So one, two, three, five. So like that. Okay, milk, red. Let's do that. Milk, red. Okay, spaghetti. Uh, spaghetti, rice. Uh... Dude, always six pack milk, dude. Was it orange? Yeah, orange juice. Six pack milk. Cake, candy. The cereal. I'm so scared to buy bleach again, because it's always a problem. Always. So... Spray. Dishwash. Soap. Uh, so, spray. Uh, dishwasher tablet. Shampoo. Toilet paper. It's toilet paper. So then it's the red one. Uh, red honey, uh, tuna, sugar. So it's red honey, tuna, and sugar. Honestly, think we should buy friends fries. Potatoes, we don't need. So we'll just buy friends fries. And, and start the day. 
They have a lot to stack first. Before someone will get stuck, I think. So let's see. We average about 50 clients. Let's see with another cash or another checkout. Will we average more? If that's the case, we might add even more. We want them in and out of the shop as soon as we can. So I think it's important that we, you know, make them be able to maneuver. So many boxes, dude. <clears throat> What do we need for that another helper? It's level 27, right? So we should be able to get them if we get enough uh, shelves. Level 29, so one more level to go. And I, yeah, there's no way we're gonna get that many shelves in here. We need to upgrade this then. Which is okay. You see, despawn, and someone else should spawn in that person's place. It could have been that guy. Let's see, despawn when? Despawn there against the wall. But it's a, it's a different game, so maybe it's not even the case in this one. Essentially, you just don't want a queue. At all. Not even slightly. So we'll see now if we get more than 50 clients, then we know it works. It's the case in this game as well. What is that? Coffee? Move, dude. Goodness. Coffee. So it seems like again we have a queue. Not really though. But all three is being used. Okay, it's gonna rack the coffee now. She's stealing. <laughs> How much tea do we have? Nothing.
Oh. Spaghetti. One in here. You see, this is the problem. Now the other guy is also stuck. Spaghetti is here. What do you have? Because this one has only two in them. And he took the full rack to put it in there. Thank you, girl. More I couldn't ask for. You see, just a neon light here would, would be great on your name. So it looks like open, you know? Could be stripes or whatever, but... That is also not a hard change to do. Too late. As I just wanted to buy toilet paper. So we'll see now. If we have more than 50 clients, then it's the case in this game as well. Dude, someone's gonna complain about the chicken. No. Really, he was walking there with... No, he wasn't. How do we fix it then? Do we put another freezer down with chicken only? Another one? I was standing on that beach. Yeah, there's no chicken, I'm sorry. I checked like a few times if we had chicken. Should have checked the storage instead. But I don't have a storage. I have this outside my building. Yeah, sorry about the chicken, dude. Okay, this is in... We're gonna buy another uh, freezer just for chicken. We'll put it here. There's nothing else I can do about it. Okay, so let's have a look. More than... No, no, it's still 50. So it doesn't work like that in this game. Candy and bread. Wow, bread went down so much, dude. So it doesn't work like that in this game, then. Did I buy two? I think I bought two. Uh, it's I, I think. So hopefully now there'll be enough chicken. No promises though. I wonder if I should just sit AFK for like 10 minutes here. <laughs> I think we should. Okay guys, I will pause the video here and uh, wait until this is done. Okay.
it's been close to 10 minutes now. This clearly just indicates that we definitely need more workers. Um, this is this is just ridiculous at this very moment. Okay, so I feel like we can start doing stock taking. Uh, let's start over here. So blue, red, sugar. So blue, red, sugar. Uh, coffee, we can actually buy a bed of coffee. And uh, eggs. We'll buy coffee again. Uh, so eggs. Uh, the red flower. Again, six pack milk. The red flower. We'll buy two six pack milks. Uh, candy. Cereal, chocolate, candy, cereal, chocolate, oh. cereal, chocolate, okay, so that's done, then it's bleach, spray, bleach, spray, toilet paper, So bleach, spray, toilet paper, uh, hand sanitizer, uh, white and red cheese. Mm. Bleach, hand sanitizer, white and red cheese. Uh, cereal, see I think chicken we can buy two, the chicken will buy two, because we have two spots to rack it, oh we don't, we shouldn't buy two, the two should be fine, and then the bees chocolate or okay so pizza and potatoes okay so we are done with stock taking we'll open the store again i honestly do think that another worker is mandatory uh even on this level we're on right now so, once we re hit 29, we're gonna just buy the upgrade for this place. And hopefully we get the whole corner until the back. And that means we can actually turn some stuff around. Uh, this rack will be just standing anywhere. Obviously, after we buy the guy, we could just box the racks, right? They don't have to be up. But this rack, this rack we don't use. I'm just curious though. We have eight racks. We have seven racks. So you, they need to be, they need to be alive. Yeah, we could just keep it boxed. Because we can't get 13 racks in here. Otherwise I would rack the racks <laughs> in boxes.
And then if we buy a license, we can use this whole place in the middle here. To do the new license. Hopefully. If there's enough space. Looks like we have two racks. Oh, it's one rack, one... Okay, we, we don't want to place this... Um... Oh, come on, dude. What did I do in my previous life to deserve this? You don't want to place it because it, it takes electricity and it adds to your electricity bill. Chicken and bleach. Will become a problem later again. Listen how sexy this is. Keep going, girl. Keep going. There we go. Keep going. Yeah, I bought way too much chicken, clearly. Four, four, four. Oh, you also? With boxed milk? See, this is again the problem. There's one milk here. Could have easily used this one milk before taking a, a, a full one. But nah, we'll take the full one and then complain that we don't have space. And if you enable the thing where they could just use unlabeled stuff, like it's just tags everywhere you have no, you have nothing you have no organization nothing you, there's it's just chaos so i would highly recommend turning that down
So this one actually needs to turn around. Not you, girl, but you can turn around anytime. <laughs> How you doing, girl? Hey. What's your number? What the heck? That was Zerl. Okay, I'm gonna do it now. <sighs> Give me five minutes with my beautiful mouse that has broken for years. But I never complained because I never really used it. The turnaround function or the scroll button. The reason why I turn it around is because the Q needs to go that way. But if you have it the wrong way around, the Q is coming from this way. To know where the, the Q is, you just have to look at uh, which direction... Um, ...the items is scrolling. So if it's scrolling that way, you know the Q is here. Girl, you know you're walking home, eh? Are you gonna carry those potatoes? Oh, okay. No problem. That's how you're gonna carry it. One bleach. Two chickens. Fun times, dude. Fun times we're about to have. Okay, so storage upgrade. Boom. Okay, so this one... Put it there for now. Because I need to move the box out of the corner. Let's turn on the light. Okay, and then it's this one. But I honestly hope they can be all next to each other. Looks like there will be enough space. Nice. So we'll mainly use those four for now. And eventually we'll use these. So, let me just double check how much we have, or how much we need. We need... Five racks in total. Five more. But we also need, like, a spit of a level. So, we'll end the day here. 50 customers again on the dot. It doesn't change. I think it only changed once, um... Once you, I don't know, get another license or something. So, what was it again? It was cheese and eggs, right? What was the other one? Yogurt. Is it just two? That might be a bit high. Uh, turn, oh, 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 you're turning the wrong way. I'm not scrolling that way, goodness. I 
I mean, we're going to remove all of these racks once we got the guy. Oh my god, I'm not scoring that way. Dude, it's been years that my scroll is broken. And I always make sure I play games that doesn't require the scroll. Wait, is that all the racks? There's one more. Okay, let's just double check the higher. 29. So that's all. Yeah, 13 out of 13. So what do you have in your hands there, buddy? Chicken again? You just don't want to let go of that chicken, do you? Does it smell good or something? Oh, rot. All rot. Like, I want to do stock, but I'm scared also. We should buy potatoes. That is something I saw that is pretty low in our store. We'll buy two of those. Oh, right. So, uh, red water eggs. Red water eggs. Okay, then it's uh, pasta, rice, Pasta, rice, ooh, what the heck, uh, chocolate, again, it feels weird, it's almost every day that I'm buying chocolate, like what's that about? I honestly don't know, how much chicken did I buy bro? Oh my goodness. Whatever, let's just buy chocolate again. The box, I think, will be small. Is it really just chocolate? Yeah. Alright, then it's... Then it's... A little bit of this. A little bit of that. A little bit of this, and then that. So, honey, the white cheese, tuna. Uh, I did buy potatoes, right? Yeah, I did. I did. Now uh, we can buy the sugar again. Okay, stock taking is done. We're level 29. So we will hire the third guy. And don't use label racks, dude. Okay. And we're open. Give me a box to stand on. So we got our third wrecker, and this is pretty much where I think we barely got a third guy. And then I was like, dude, the game, it's just becoming too hard for me to like manage. But now we have a whole system. We can leave the racks up for now. You know, we can use these racks instead to like duplicate toilet paper and chicken. Like, make a whole rack for just toilet paper and a whole rack. That's too much. Maybe, like, a rack down. Just 
just like, dude, I'm so tired of them standing there with that. Bleach as well. So, Bleach. So, that issue is gone. Uh, toilet paper. Oh, we didn't buy that. So now we can actually move this over. Goodness, can I grab this box? Thank you. Holy. So grab that. Put it there. And potato needs to move on also. We also need to make... Oh, we have potato. So potato moves on. What? Oh my goodness, bro. Okay. So now we need chips. Potato chips. French fry. There we go. Our dude is standing there again. There we go. What are you... What are you? Box milk. So... No, I don't think we need to do this for box milk, right? It's just... Stuff like this that gets to me the whole time. I should just do this. They will go put up the new box. I'll, I'll do it. It's a simple change the developer has to do, honestly. The priority of how they maneuver. Dude, I just placed in the milk. Are oh, you going there to place one? Nice. That's why you get the big bucks, dude. Okay, so let's have a look at the next license we need to buy. Next license requires level 16. Is that really how far we behind we are? The two next ones are 16 and then it's 25. And then it jumps to 30. By the way, um, this this shelf we have, I feel like it should be at the back, so it's not bothering us for stock taking. So eventually, maybe not eventually, maybe right now. you turn?
Wait, is that the wrong one? Yeah, it is. I removed the label. Nice. When I try to pick it up. A toilet paper label. Honestly think we can get it. Yeah, we can get another one next time. So for now, we don't need these. Okay. So these are just for doubles for now. Cheese, coffee, light, roast, bottled water, eggs, 12 pack, pasta, elbows, sugar brown, tea green. So right now, this is going to be, if I buy that license, I will be further with the game than when I restart it. And we accidentally removed a toilet paper, I think. Yeah. We need more light here. Management. We'll buy two lights. Nice. Orange. Orange juice. And a red. Orange juice is like here. <gasps> what the fuck did I place? It's left of boxed milk. It's apple juice. Okay, is everyone out? Yeah. Everyone's out. So we'll end the day here. This poor guy is going to sleep with the, the box in his hand. We got 52 cl uh, clients now. So that's the most we got so far. Okay, so we want... We want to attack that apple juice. We'll get to the light soon. That's honey. Here we go. So... It's this one here. Red spaghetti. Okay, we want toilet paper. So we can just fix that issue. That we removed one label accidentally. Perfect. Okay. Okay, so we'll go grab the spaghetti. 
this one and this one. Yeah, open a fucking new box, you idiot. Ugh. Oh, I need to calm down, dude. But it's not gonna get better by itself. That's the problem here. It's not something I can do to make it better. This is this is a coding issue. This is honestly a coding issue. Tuna. Uh, the tuna's here, no? See, I need to keep the ba the the box in my hand so that he would use the the less box. So we're going to replace all of this eventually. Oh, dude. I don't care how it looks. What do you got there? Tuna again? Do you like the smell? Holy. Do you like the smell? Do you like it when the whiff of tuna hits your nose? Because it sure looks like it, buddy. So trying, are you trying to tell me something? Did we buy potatoes? I honestly swear we did. We did. Why is it not racked? Oh, there you go. Okay. Well, this guy is going to stand there until Tuna gets bought, I guess. Unless I just do this. Or now. Okay, let's uh, do our daily stock take. We are in needing of... We'll eventually remove the chicken, though. Should we just do it now? Is it the last? No. Oh, yeah, it's the third one. Here. Somewhere. Is it the bottom? Yeah, it is. Okay, there we go. So, are we going to work from the bottom? Sure. We need red... Hand sanitizer. Hand sanitizer. Hand sanitizer. Toilet paper. Uh, bleach. What the bleach, dude? We almost buy everyday bleach. So we'll buy that. So that is that side done, I think. Yep. Okay, then we'll scroll all the way to the top. Make it never, never stop. One hop. Okay, so cereal bread. So one, two, three. Boom. One, two, three. Uh, below that. And then coffee. Below that. And coffee. 
That's 10. Buy it. So buy coffee. Then tea. We'll buy, we'll buy double coffee, double tea, though. Okay. And like this, we need orange juice and sodas. What do we need? Apple juice? No. We need the last soda also. Okay. We need cake and candy, and that's it. So cake, candy, and boom. Bob's your uncle. Okay, let's go. Let's open the day. And we're open. Let's get down. Let's get down to business. Dude, my minions need to run faster, honestly. Is this guy Mew? I don't think I've seen him before. He's like, I grow muscle. I'm big. I have big back. Dude, even with three workers, it still looks like trash outside. So we'll eventually have to get that fourth one. Eventually. Just out of curiosity. How many product license is there still? Oh. My. Oh my, oh, oh, oh my god. <laughs> Excuse me? How will we ever, how in the world will we ever, if this dickhead doesn't even know how to stack. Ever deal with that amount. Yeah, I don't think there's any possible way to get there. With four workers, even. Unless you take, like, the mornings extremely slow. You buy and you fucking sit. Because, like, if you all tap out of the game, the game pauses itself. It has to be your main screen. So I can't sit here and have my crypto projects and stuff at the background open. Like, it doesn't work. So, the game has to be main screen. So, I don't know what I'm going to do to try and get that high. It's going to be insane, dude. 
I honestly can't imagine how big your shop will be. I I can't think it will just go till here. Unless it will break down backwards as well. Out of, again, out of curiosity, growth. <sighs> Requires level 99. $160,000 to open the final one. Goodness, dude. We're never restarting ever again. That's for sure. So in theory, like how how many like how long hours would it take to quote unquote finish the game? Have every product on the store, have every section bought, have every storage bought. You know, it's not that many storage left, dude. If you think about it. And we like we we're gonna have another rack in front of this one. And even then, it's going to, like, block us from looking around. So there's one with six, and he decided, hey, let me, let me grab the one that's full, because the one that's full on the floor, that's just better. And I was going to put one back that's not full. Let me try and manually solve it. Yeah, really grab the one on the floor. Okay, there you go. It's taking the box out. You itty fucking idiot. Yeah, you, you can just chill there for the rest of your night be useless. Honestly, with this coding issue, like, I don't know. Like, I think I will also have to, like, rack like a maniac. <laughs> While playing... Hey, dude, that's a lot of guns you got there. Oh, eat your chicken, girl. Wow. Goodness, I can see my home from here, dude. I don't know if I go home with you. Let this eat up with the box stay there. I go. Dude, shut up. You stupid. There's better ways to do it, but you do it the, the wrong way. There's honestly nothing I can personally do about it. It's a coding issue. Hey. Hopefully got rid of the box now, son. Our last uh, customer for the day. No, there's one more at the back there. Is it like buying the store or like what the heck? He's still not done, dude. This should be a big one, I think.
Not even a hundred dollars. Goodness. Fifty-three satisfied cu uh, customers. That's what I'm talking about, bro. So, sugar, chicken, sliced bread. Sugar and chicken. Oh, which sugar though? Mommy, I don't know where to put the box. <laughs> so I just hold it. Uh, which sugar? Is it the yellow sugar? No. So it's the white sugar. There it is. We're gonna type 88. Nah, we'll make it 490. That's seven cents in me pocket. Uh, where's the tuna? It's over here. Hopefully one of you will get the better box now. That's probably this guy. This one's still not full. Okay, there we go. So that issue is out of our lives. That's what I'm talking about. Okay, is it stock taking time? Yeah, it is, dude. What the heck? Get out of my way. So much boxes standing around. So this is old tea. Soda. 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 So we're not going to buy the soda. Or tea. We have one tea here, but... Just use that, dude. Okay, so we don't buy any soda or tea. Okay, let's start. We. Okay, so one. Three, four. Uh, cheese. That's 10, right? Yeah. So that's 10. Then it's milk. Milk. Red. And box milk. Box milk. And chocolate. It's like I'm always buying chocolate, dude. It never gets fold. Like it's like laying somewhere. Let me just buy another chocolate. Maybe even the shelf is quite low. Where is the shelf? It's... Did I move it? Oh, that's my other game. It was there. Right, I don't even know where it is. There it is. We'll just buy a double, right? Double chocolate, because it feels like it never fills up. Okay, so double chocolate's done. So we start from up here. Uh, so bleach, uh, shampoo, honey. So bleach, shampoo, honey. 
We'll double, we'll double honey. Uh, chicken. Chicken. We'll double cereal also, just for fun. And chicken again. And potato. And pizza. Okay, we can uh, we can open the store. Stock taking is done. I can't imagine how long it will take when you have a huge store. It would be so cool if you could pay someone to do the stock taking. Your days would be so much faster. Even if it shows you here, like you have this much on shelf, you have this much on uh in in storage right and this much on street nice uh physics you got there my friend let me jump on it it even carries my weight dude that's what i'm talking about don't take my box nice So maybe the clients that you get in your store is actually level-based and nothing else. Because why would we go to 52 now if you were on 50 the whole time? The only thing that changed is we went up a level, we bought a better, bigger storage, and we hired someone else also, right? So maybe maybe it goes up with your level. At least that's that would make sense to me. I don't know what else it could be. I actually have no idea. What? There's no one that took a box. But the box is gone. What the damn hell? Are you winning, son? I'm sure we have pizza laying outside somewhere, right? It's a lot of bees. Yeah, there's the pizza. Holy, you're big. You is new also. Or is the... Okay, that, no, don't say that. Stop talking <laughs> before it's too late. <laughs> but he's so far the only character that's bigger than us that I've seen. Goodness, dude. It sounds like Christmas over here. Doesn't sound like Christmas. I mean, people say Christmas sounds like jingle bells, jingle. No, it sounds like this. Okay, maybe not on Christmas, but a few days before. People getting their 13th check, they're just like, oh boy, I'm gonna go buy two months of shopping. And then just waste it on one meal for the family. Almost level 30.
And also, like, even though we're still around 50 customers per day, it's like they buy so much more on average. So the people that bought like one or two items in the beginning, it's the same people coming in, but now they're buying 10 to 15 items instead of one or two. Okay, 15 is a bit extreme, but it's around, you know, that physics or logic, what I'm saying. I want to put music up for these guys and for you guys also watching, but the music in this game is copyright. And the only way you can get the music playing is by buying a speaker. Hmm. Maybe we can turn the audio down with music. I don't know. I don't think it's going to help with clients coming. We're running low on toilet paper again? I mean, they love stocking toilet paper, so I assume we do. Looks like you're struggling there with the machine girl. You're like leaning forward. Let me put on the light for you. I can be your light in your life if you want me to. Oh yeah. People streaming in. We should close at 9, but... Do you think they care? Oh, in all honesty? Oh, the box milk is always loaded. Or the plastic milk. <laughs> And there's more milk coming in one of the licenses we can get. Did I just see you? Nah, bro, it's my brother. It's my brother from another mother. It's my brother from another AI developer. How long are we going to do this before we buy the next uh, license? I don't know how much money we want though before we do it. Because we're like halfway with the racking and stuff. Okay, I think that's everyone. So we'll end it here. 55, you see, 55 now. We went up in a level. So the amount of customers coming in is, um, is tied to your level. That's the only thing it's tied to. How's it looking outside? Toilet paper, toilet paper, potato. Bees, knees, toilet paper. So we don't have to buy potato most probably and, and toilet paper. But whether we do or not, it doesn't matter because we have a full rack that's empty. So we'll just buy what we see. So two... 
Um, red sugar. So there's a whole line of coffee. So two red sugar and then the whole line of coffee. Okay. Should we just buy coffee again? Sure. We'll buy four coffees, dude. Um, okay. Out of oil. So then it's, uh, okay, one, two, and then box milk. I think we'll buy quite a bit of box milk as well. We'll buy four box milk and then candy. So candy and then it's this side. So spray. Spray, cleaner, toilet paper. White and red cheese. Okay, that's 10. Uh, then we need uh, chicken. And we need potato. Uh, we need French fries and potato. French fries. Oh, that's 10. So, French fries and potato. Um. And chicken, dude. Okay, stock taking is done. Let us continue on. <laughs> dude, what is this mess? I honestly just don't know how we're gonna get to... You know, having like a hundred products up. Like, I honestly just don't see it, dude. To think we can only have, only have four stalkers, restockers. How? How in the world, dude? How are we going to get triple our products? Maybe even more than that. With one more helper. I honestly just can't see it. Unless we AFK every morning. Until this mess is in our freaking storage. And also the developer fixed the code of them using the storage first before using the pool boxes outside. The woman in this game is... You understand what I'm saying? And dude, since we bought so much and our road is full of, like, boxes, we don't hear cars drive by anymore. When we started the game, there was cars everywhere, dude. It was even a traffic jam on, uh, up until, like, here because of people walking across. But when last did you hear a car drive here? We're killing the environment, dude. In all honesty. Maybe it's not our fault. There's no car anywhere.
And even here, the TT from here. There's cars. Is it a traffic jam or like what's happening? Bro. You're stopping all the cars. Oh my goodness. Okay, so the only way to fix that is to relog, I think. And then nobody got time for that. So I assume there can only be like five cars on the road and they're all stuck on the same car. Yo, imagine running around a bit and no one is stuck with items in their hands? Goodness. We're getting somewhere. Also guys, let me know in the comment section if there is someone that is like close to finishing the game. Or that did finish the game. Because I want to see their shop, you know. I would be super impressed. Because I know there's people quite far with the game, but I can't imagine a full store. I, I honestly can't. With all the products in the game that you get. Level 99. Like just based on like how many hours it would take. Just to even remotely get close to that. Ooh, the potatoes is definitely stocked. So there's one potato. There's one potato. There's three potato. There's two potato. There's one potato. There's three potato. What the fuck is wrong, dude? The it doesn't take a brain cell to notice, hey, there's a glitch in the game, and we need to fix it. In all honesty, bro. If people take a potato there, they're like, okay, I'm gonna take a new one out. No, you should use the ones we have that's in storage. It's a big issue, man. It, it really is. It's going to make things drastically more harder to fight against code that is not meant to be. That's not intended. I mean, in all honesty, I can't be the only one complaining about this. I think we have to do like one more full day before we buy the new license. So we'll most probably do this in the next episode though. But for now we're gonna do one more day and then call it. Because the video is only 51 minutes. It takes roughly about eight, eight minutes per day. And they, until you get people like this that comes in 10 minutes, like half an hour past nine. And this guy that still want to do their shopping. So I'm sure this was well beyond, above and beyond 50 customers. The 
Look at my bots working hard. How's the potatoes looking now? It's still the same. I think she's the last one in. Yeah. So she's done. End the day. So we'll do one more full day. Oil. Cereal. And cheese. I don't know which cheese. Wait, that's cake. The other cheese should be inside a fridge. So it's one of these cheese. There we go. That is a big difference. It's maybe too expensive. And I forgot the others. It took me so long to find it. Uh, so that's cheese, okay. Uh, that's cereal. Next to the chocolate. And normal oil. And then the oil, the starting oil. All raw tea then. Let us buy. One. Two. Coming for you. Three, four, lock the door. How much cheese do we have on... Let's see here. That's still okay. So only one of those. Okay. Eight pack, eight pack milk, and then everything below that. We should have a look at stuff like olive oil. Still good. Red, still good. You know what? Still good. So two is enough. Um. Okay. So spaghetti, orange juice. Apple juice, spaghetti, orange juice, apple juice. I think we could buy milk again, the six pack milk. It's only one left anyway. Okay, so six pack milk, then these two and one below. Wait, cool drink. Right. One, two, three. One, two, three. Yes, I assume we still have a lot of uh, of yogurt. Okay, so bleach. No, no, we need spray, hand sanitizer, spray, hand sanitizer. Uh, sure, we can get some shampoo. Uh, white cheese. White cheese. Um, eggs. Eggs. 
and sugar. Sugar. Uh, butter is still okay, I think. And uh, chicken. We'll buy double chicken. Uh, we need fries. We need, just need fries then. Pizza is still okay, it looks like. 37. So we'll buy and open shop. We. And then we'll do this day, and then we're done. But in real time for me, tomorrow I'm gonna play the card game again. I'm gonna play, like, the card game and this game, like, shuffle them off every day. Until we're done with both of them. Because, like, I wanna, I wanna somehow, some way, get known for simulation games like this. Because it's honestly... The game is very easy, but the deeper you get into it, the harder the game becomes. And it's it's exponentially harder. Like, when you start the game, it's... Dude, it's... A, a potato can play it, right? You... they Like, they teach you the basics of how the game works to expand, to have a storage, to get a worker. Um, but the game at the, like... I don't know, the top end like level 60-ish, it becomes extremely difficult. Like, you have to have a proper system in place. You can't just be doing stuff weirdly and expect results, you know? And I feel like it's it's most it's most simulation games is like that. Um, and that's why the biggest channels, they make like a part or two of the game. They play the easiest parts. Where, you know, gas simulator, it's like cleaning the place. It's like getting your first, getting the ball rolling, right? But they they won't continue on with the game where the game is like really tough. It's the same with us, honestly. Like, just a dumb example, Markiplier... Uh, made three episodes about this game. And I think he bought licenses two times. And that's as far as he goes, dude. And that's where the game basically only starts, right? Like, I'm already further than he is in the game. Quite far. Yeah, you can wait for one person to... Or I could just be a dick. So we have two boxes of one. That's just great. So just doing that most probably will fix it. Come on. The the they say the box milk is nice. If someone buys one, I'll, I'll put everything down. But I think they're gonna restock it very soon with another box. Normally this is like flying off the shelf, dude. What's happening? Here he comes. Oh. Thank you. So that issue was solved now, guys. Very good, very good. 
Nope, clearly not. What do you have? Potato. Okay, I could solve that also. Very good, very good. We take the one potato and we're like, mine. And then I put it back quickly. And then I put... Sounds like Christmas in here, dude. Let's go. Why did you stop, girl? Wait, come back. You need more items, I know it. I can see in your eyes. You're standing in queue when there's two open, dude. Not anymore, you're too late. I mean, this game don't need music. This is music to our ears, right? Cha-ching! Only that? You're a disgrace to this place, dude. You can do better. But I can't imagine a actual cashier being faster than this. There's two chickens gone, people. Like, what are you gonna do about it? Is that a potato again? Yeah, it's another potato, dude. Let me help you quickly. I take the one, and I say, this is my potato, and I put back. Yeah, the chips, I don't know what to do with you, dude. We can do the same thing, I guess. That's pizza. So I keep this one in my hand. You take the one again. There you go. Now go restock it. Go restock it. Wait, you walk around it? One milk. <laughs> Let me help you. That's not milk. Let me let me help you quickly. There you go. It's just a coding issue. It's not it's not that you need help. It's that the coder needs help. It's just, it's literally, he has the code already. It's literally just, he needs to switch the priority from outside boxes to inside. That's it. The priority list is, is just wrong. It's just incorrect. Should be inside first and then outside. Whatever is in stock, uh, stock first before they grab a box that's outside. If the inside is empty, like Chuna right now, they will grab the outside. Obviously, the priority is to have items in store, which is the right priority. But this, where they get the supply from is not the correct one. Yeah, this is just chaos, dude, honestly. I don't know how they can fix this as well. 
other than us just sitting here for 10 minutes. I'm trying to think of something that can make it better. Like, I honestly can't. Like, you want the people to stock them. Like, if I was actually the cashier of this place, right? And they are the restockers. Because that's all they do. Hmm. I, in all honesty, have no answer for this. How to fix that. Because this is still only 30 products. Imagine this whole pile of boxes once you get to the end game. And I mean, sure, like it doesn't really matter too much, right? Because they will use the stock inside. And if there's no inside, they will use the stock that's outside to, to put down. But they don't. So... Not just will these guys use the wrong boxes. The priority at least inside is correct in the store. Well, not really though, right? It's a bit extreme on toilet paper, um, uh, chicken and potatoes. Because if someone takes one potato out of this whole rack, he will go and get a potato first. Like that's his priority then. So, bread. Okay, we'll end the day there. Tablet is down. 20.8. Was it 20.7 20 is fine. I mean, guys, in all honesty, we're making money like there's no tomorrow. It's just I get a little bit frustrated with these workers that they're standing there with two items in their hand or, or a box with two items in it. But there's another box here with also two items in it so either they can just put the box in and they somehow merge and the problem is solved instantly so those two items and two separate boxes will now become one box with four items in it that can also work or the priority needs to change so that they only use the items inside the storage first before they touch the outside storage the new items. Bread is a problem again? <gasps> He's gonna put it down there, watch. Okay, we need to remove that bread icon. Uh, it's left of coffee, whatever it might be. It was cheese. Cheese knees. It was the cheese. There we go. So I can almost restock. Now they're carrying stuff inside. Okay, let's restock. So we start with oil, then red. Oil, red, then eggs, then red again. So eggs, red again. Uh, then
one, two, three. So pasta, one, two, oh. So one, two, and then candy and the white one, white one and candy. So that's the shelf done. So move on to the next one. Uh, bleach. You son of a bleach. So bleach. Uh, so bleach, dishwash tablet, and sanitizer. Uh, toilet paper. That's 10. We also get experience. We went to level 31 now. We're buying items. Um, we'll go tuna. So red, then tuna. We'll buy mozzarella cheese also. Mozzarella cheese, red, then tuna. Um, we're somewhat fine on the eggs. So I'm going to buy it anyway. Because it's small packs. Um, and then potato. Don't really need potato, but I'm going to buy anyway. And there we go. Stock is done. Not that much, to be honest. Was expecting more. You see, the programming is they will always take the lowest stock first. But what if you have stuff like this, where there's it's not like seven boxes fit inside here, right? It's like this. What then? What's the priority then? I don't know. It's It's kind of weird. But anyway, guys, we're going to actually end this video over here. Hope you guys did enjoy. If you did, please make sure to leave a like. Subscribe if you're new. And I'll catch you in the next one. Peace.